everybody, I'm Johnny and today we are taking a look at five of the greatest aircraft scenes in movie cinema history. Starting from newest to oldest, Dark Blue World 2001. This scene from Dark Blue World features a real Spitfire Mark 5B flown by the amazingly talented Nigel Lamb. Lamb gives us some incredible low level flying that involved timing the Spitfire both the chase crew and a moving train. It cost $10,000 per hour to rent this Spitfire and was the most expensive scene in Czech cinema history. Check out the whole movie if you are a World War II aircraft fan. It's a masterpiece incorporating scenes from both the Memphis Bell and Battle of Britain. Empire of the Sun, 1987. It's actually a prisoner of war movie, not strictly an aircraft movie, but gives us one of the very best aircraft finishes in movie history. Here we have legendary pilot Ray Hanna giving us brilliant low level flying in a P-51D Mustang. Three fully restored P-51Ds were used in the 10 day filming of this scene. Nineteen seventy seven, a bridge too far. Beautiful Mark Nine flown by the late Neil Williams poses as a low level fighter reconnaissance Spitfire. It's a short but beautiful scene. The Spitfire flown in this film is one of the most famous World War II cinema Spitfires ever, MH four three four. During World War II, Flight Lieutenant Henry Lardner Burke shot down two FW one nineties with this Spitfire, and the Spitfire went on to fly with the Royal Netherlands Air Force after the war. What the hell kind of traffic control is this? I was trying to tell you, sir, the radio said something about an attack. They're Japs, sir! Tora 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 1970 features a number of terrific aircraft scenes, but one of the most sensational is the landing of a Boeing B-17 Flying Fortress because it's an actual non-planned crash landing. It resulted from jammed landing gear, and luckily the cams were rolling during the event. The plane sustained only minor damage and the crew was just fine. A total of five Boeing B-17s were obtained for filming, the scene was so valued that it was reused in the 1976 film Midway. Starlight control to dovetail. Keep an eye out for a friendly wing joining you on your port side. Roger, Starlight. I see him. I see him. Bloody marvelous. Battle of Britain, 1969. Hard to pick just one scene from Battle of Britain, but this one is especially great, however, because it features Polish hurricane fighters flying alongside Spitfires facing off against ME-109s and Heinkels. 27 Spitfires out of a total of 12 Airworthy were used in the filming of Battle of Britain, along with three Airworthy Hurricanes. The measurement 109s were procured from the Spanish Air Force. The production company also procured real Heinkels, Two Junkers 52s and even a B-25 Mitchell bomber was used as a camera plane. Though the tactical formations of the Spitfires and Hurricanes flying together were not always accurate in the film, it remains one of the most authentic aircraft movies to date. Thanks for watching this brief breakdown of five great aircraft scenes. If you want to support the channel, please like and subscribe, and we'll see you next time.